think about the teaching faculty in MSMS, they really all, we all come from a completely different perspective. We're all not trained in the same element of business. Most of us are probably practitioners, but some of us have run companies, some of us have raised money for companies, others of us still run companies. I think from the student's perspective, it's not only a matter of enriching it a little bit more from a cultural perspective or a language perspective, but you ultimately are getting a diverse set of practitioners who are able to, again, outside of the curriculum, and the curricula that we might be teaching across multiple courses, uh, the faculty is able to interject their own unique set of experiences, and in my case, in addition to that, languages and cultural uh, overlays. The faculty, they're awesome because they all are like really experienced from a diverse set of backgrounds, um, and they're really willing to help you outside of class too, and for any career questions. So they're great resources uh, just throughout the whole program because they, they do care about you. I find it very uh, energizing in the classroom. When we think about the fact that when you go into a business environment, you're not just going in working with people from your same background. You're going in to work with people from these various backgrounds that we see around campus. And the fact that you are in trying to work with students, you're trying to elicit these backgrounds and have them see that there's different ways of thinking about things and using that energy of thought and that diversity uh, to approach business. Business isn't, isn't unidimensional and, and problems can be solved in different ways by people with different backgrounds. You really have to layer the kind of learning that you're experiencing. You have to understand the different topics and integrate them immediately. You have to be able to apply them immediately. It's a way of learning that is um, part of who you are. You have to embody them. It's not just learning something and then writing an essay. It's you're learning something and you're doing it and you're making a mistake and you're learning really fast from that mistake and then you're never making that mistake again. So I think, I think it works. Well, one of the things I like about the faculty in the program is the fact that number one, they're very personable. Because of the fact that we are coming of different backgrounds, the faculty understands that our perspective and our opinions comes from different situations and because of that the faculty tries to make a situation or a scenario wherein our learning becomes really wholesome and they do not disregard uh, I mean I want to emphasize on this they do not disregard our prior training so let's say for example I came from a music background and some of my teammates were actually good at mathematics some of them finished accounting and some of them finished uh, visual arts and because of that once we are formulating into a team we are able to make a wholesome presentation not only in the corporate setup but coming from different avenues the faculty are really driven uh, they're really they really care about us students and they really want us to succeed uh, i think that was one of the main th takeaways that i had from this program was that they really really care about their students and they are constantly urging us to ask questions, urging us to talk to them after class, urging us to visit them and learn as much as possible so that you know we're prepared for our eventual careers once the program is over. I have built a lot of digital applications for some of the largest universities uh, and largest clients in the world. And so for me, one of the things that makes me really excited is that I can teach these students and share with them the experience that I have building those applications and creating really pivotal digital experiences. Um, and because I've done that so much in my career and still do, what I bring to the classroom is what it's like today, what it's like tomorrow. So it's very relevant and it's very real. The fact that I have done both professional work and worked internationally and developed and run organizations and did and done projects uh, and coupling that with the academic aspect, allows me to, to add color to what I'm teaching, to add different experiences uh, and picking up threads in, in cases uh, and the like and being able to, to put it together. The students are much more engaged when you can tell them a personal story about here's how I've experienced that. And the fact that it's uh, the experience that I've had is, is international, since a number of our students come from countries outside the U.S., it helps to make connections to them also so they don't feel that it's just a U.S.-centric uh, view of the world of business. I think that helps connect also. Questor means case competitions. Questor means humility. Questor means scrappy. 
Questrom means a can-do attitude. Questrom means success after they get the piece of paper and go out and do us proud in the world after they start working and applying what they have learned in the classroom. Questrom means possibilities. Questrom means utilizing diversity of thought and perspective to solve business problems.